You want a piece of me, boy? And welcome back to Hit the Sauce Gaming. Hit the Sauce Gaming. All right, so Blizzard logged me out for no fucking reason, so let's hop right back in. It's okay. They're, you know what they're probably <laughs> just doing is some ghost uh, virus is just making you put all your information in, and then it knows all your stuff now. I mean, if it wants my three bucks, it can have it. It just took your three dollars. Now, ah, uh, crap. And it sent you a ton of porn. <laughs> Yay! Free porn! Free porn! Uh, Quagmire, you do know that you can get porn on the internet. What? what? If I I'll, I'll be back. <laughs> Jack darn. <laughs> anyway, so this is the greatest cutscene of all time. All of the fucking uh, StarCraft 2 uh, uh, freaking now you boys gotta wake up. Uh, uh, expansions and shit I join this out have uh, one fucking cutscene that's just Everybody weird as shit. Down. There's Dragon Ball Z cutscene in uh, in Which part of the swarm, now. it's just fucking weird. Yeah. You'll you'll know what what kind of thing I'm talking you, about here. What's wrong? They're they're thinking about mutinying and shit. Yeah. Yeah. Jim, yeah. Jimmy's yeah. allying yeah. with the Dominion. Yeah. You've been nothing but poison since you got on this crate. And Tychus is still pissed at Jimmy. Yeah. Right. And all that shit. Funny and dwarf. The only person you can trust is yourself. The sooner you peons figure that out. Heard about enough of this. Oh shit. Man, I wish I had a survive that never went out. Oh shit. See, you can't you just hold something food, in your mouth like that. The smoke you will you blow right up into your nose. It does. First yeah, but most people actually are just used to it. You'll just duck and run. This is what you do, ain't it? Me, them, that. Pretty little girlfriend of yours. The fuck? That was very slow. Man. This, this fucking cutscene, man. Fuck is what? <laughs> Whoa. It's fucking amazing. Isn't he worried about the fact that, that guy has a huge fucking suit? You think so, right? This is supposed to make him strong, isn't it? No! Not the jukebox! Don't do something you're gonna regret, Tigus. Fucking dude, this thing, this whole Ted thing is weird. Wow, he's being really badass. Before he just looked like a troubled man. I'm just gonna run out on you. You got us working for the Dominion now, Commander. Taking us back to Char. It's like you're gone already. He's speaking really freely to him. Our war's always been about saving lives. Yeah, such huge hands. Yeah. If the Zerg wipe everyone dwarf. out, it's all been for nothing. So I'm going back to Char. Then again, that's about the proportion of my hand. Because you can choice. fit your thumb and forefinger like across your been. face. So you can touch now your cheekbones. And it looks like they can do the same. Satisfied? Oh, never mind. I mean, he's got a giant hand. <laughs> he's got a giant hand. <laughs> I, I don't I don't believe that he's able to just kick him like that. Yeah. I don't want to have to have this conversation again. And fix my damn jukebox. You can't fix that shit. He has no idea how to make glass. <laughs> it's fixed by the next cutscene. Is it? Yep. Well, then you ruined the ending. <laughs> Alright, we're done. That was the true story. Yep. Star the story over. of the jukebox. Yep. He fixes the jukebox. Game over. So yeah, that was all. That that was kind of weird. Yeah. Fucking amazing. So you said this was the best cutscene ever? Yeah, best cutscene ever. It's like. No, I was obviously joking. Oh, okay. Never mind. Yeah. I can't tell when you're being sarcastic. <laughs> it was. It was. It was fucking weird. Or facetious. All right. So let's see what Horn has to say. You still got a okay. problem with us working alongside? I want to see his wife. And give me a beer, please. Okay. Do I get to drink this one too? to be a ruthless dictator, but that shouldn't automatically condemn his son. I followed you through hell and back, sir. 
I'm not quitting on you now. Good man. This truce won't last forever. Just long enough to get the job done. On a personal note, nice job. Sorry for nice. the sniffling. That ass kicking's been a long time coming. All right, let's see what's up on the communicator. Well, Junior, we got our hands on the final artifact. Wait, why is Junior not capitalized? Of the whole set at any time. Thank you, Commander. That's not his actual well name, done. I guess. You're every bit as resourceful. <coughs> I don't know. He's still, he's still using it as a proper noun, so yeah. They're stacking in our favor. Because Commander, hope so. Delivering this artifact thing right to Kerrigan's doorstep. We're gonna need all the luck we can get. Rest easy. We'll have the might of the Dominion fleet behind us. Right. All right. So I think there's a couple things we need to know. Sup, Swan. How are you holding up down here, Chief? Better. Now we got our old commander back. Oh, and our new best friend, Prince Charming, came through with some upgraded battle. See, I knew he was a dwarf. I've been he working knows Prince Charming. Interesting modifications. You're really riding this. Yes. <laughs> Where we're going. Well, I got. I don't have all the fire bitches to make fun of anymore. So now I got to pick on somebody. Okay. And lab, nothing should be. Yeah, go ahead and grab the three thousand credits. Cool. And yeah, you notice that the artifact is gone. Yeah. Because uh, they're they're doing stuff to it. Uh -huh. And uh, Cantina is the last place we need to go. I like how they have him sitting, standing over here after that, found him sitting in his usual spot. Uh, we'll go ahead and talk to Tosh ah, first. He is my man. How can I be helping you, Mr. Rayner? You sit up here watching everything. Tell me what you see. Tiger's just a mean drunk. I wish it was just that. All that jealousy and rage. He's fighting himself over something he don't want to do. So that seer is seeing see. that he's going to betray us. Mm. News. Mm. This is Donnie Vermillion. Live from UNN Studios on Corhall. Troubling news tonight, as Crown Prince Valerian seems to have gone missing. Wonder if the That's voice right, Donnie. Prince Valerian was scheduled to speak at the launch of the Dominion's newest battle cruiser, the White Star. But the ceremony had to proceed without the prince yeah. when he failed to arrive. Official like government sources offered no comment. The Whatever the situation, the we here at UNN <laughs> hope the prince is okay. Oh, Junior, Junior, Junior just fine. Too. So You're a... <laughs> Worse, man. <laughs> I know. <laughs> he has in that trouble with new, low people. Neutron stars. You really Those are tell awesome. me what the hell that was all about. Man, uh, these last few weeks, helping you fight the good fight, I finally got a taste of what real freedom is. But that's all coming to an end with you charging off like some damn hero for a cause I couldn't care less about. Then what was all that talk earlier about doing humanity a favor? And getting paid well in the process. Just seems the closer we get to your Queen of Blades. Well, let's just say things don't always work out the way you plan, Jimmy. I need you with me on this one, Tigus. Trust me. Why do people pick up these things? Oh, right. oh, the fact right. that he's like I'm giving them little subtle That's hints. That's my boy. Hey, uh, be well, aware. I don't think you're gonna go there, and I'm gonna have to kill you. Oh. I don't think uh, Rainer is even in in canon to portrayed as the um, smartest guy. Yeah, but it's, uh, it's true. And Horner's been suspicious of him the entire time, and Tosh is a fucking psychic, so he already knows regardless. Yeah. Even and, though they're making this obvious because it's part of the storyline, and they want people to kind of think it, and hey, maybe there might be a plot twist later on, I'm not going to say anything, you don't have to ruin anything, but... Uh, even then, like communicating with somebody on a day-to-day -day basis, you, you you pick up little subtle. Well, they've been separated cues. for uh, for years, and I, I know, uh, but they've been. You only... spend a week with somebody. Still, I don't know if I pick up on somebody that quickly in a week. I'm not very observant when it comes to the primary people. If I hung out with you for five days again, straight, you no think you'd learn back. something more about like Ensure my personal that you are fully prepared, Commander. I already Destiny know all there is to know about you. Exactly. Anyway, we're going to Char. Char. That's the Zerg homeworld. Really? Because yep. it looks like a fucking charred land. But a... Man. Uh, yeah. I, I wonder if that's where they I'm got the gonna, name. I'm just going to drink my beer. All right. Once the char invasion begins, you will be unable to leave char and complete missions on other planets. Uh oh We better go finish out all the other missions, dude. Is that what it said? Let's, yeah, let's go and... Oh. Oh, that's the only mission oh. left. Oh. That's because we did all the side quests at the yeah. very earliest <laughs> opportunity. <laughs> That was all your right. choice, not my choice. Man, this episode may just be all cutscenes and story. Yeah, two characters? Yeah. 
Fuck, we already did like a podcast episode. May as fucking well. Yeah, I'm sorry for that podcast, by the way. No, it, was, it was good. It was good. I'm not, I wasn't talking the about the, the, uh... Tectonic storm. Actually, I'm sorry that you're even listening to this right now. I mean, we are two drunk people we playing video games. Indeed, it's pretty awesome. Wait, yeah. Wow, we have a fucking good life. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Let's go sit in the hot tub. Your okay. nice clean time table. Probably not. I'm gonna fall asleep. I have a hot tub. Yes. I like to mention that because it makes me sound all rich and bald. It has lights and jets. And yeah, it does. The lights are pretty cool. I wish we could turn on human feces. I hope not. Oh. You didn't want that on there? Oh, I hate you. No, you should pay attention to this. Okay. Unforeseen contingencies. So that's Warfield, remember, the, com- the general, or uh, the supreme commander of the Dominion forces. Not him. Yeah. The guy in the big white face. Okay. Uh, Marine. That guy. And, uh, Boris Warfield, the greatest military name ever. And boom! I've just received a report you've taken half the fleet. Just explain yourself, boy. Father, I am about to accomplish that which you never could. Today, I will defeat the Queen of Blades and secure peace throughout the Dominion. By this act, the people will finally know that I am a worthy successor to you. Wow, just look at these things. There's a I big head and a little person. Son. I wonder what the guy on the other side is seeing. <laughs> is, is he a, does he see a big head, too, or does he see a person No, nope, because then he just walks in. So I assume he sees the whole room, but that's always weird, because you don't see anything else. Just I don't know what gutter my son fished you out of, but even you've got to realize that treacherous bitch cannot be saved, and neither can you. We'll see about that. And when this is over, you and me got a score to settle. Lame. Oh, shit. You just changed the song on that jukebox. Everything I could have <laughs> hoped for. You're playing a dangerous game, he's kid. Prince Valerian, we have Zerg oh, no. attack waves incoming. Already? From the from the homeworld? Yeah, they're coming out from uh, Char. How the f- I thought, why is things still alive there? Because that's their homeworld. That's where fucking Kerrigan's hanging out right now. Uh-oh. That looks fucked. Clear the bridge. I got a battle to win. He's still gonna go win that battle. Yeah. He's commander badass, motherfucker. He's Master I'll Chief. I'll see you boys on the ground. Actually, <laughs> Master Chief's a woman. Sure, why not? Sure, why not? Her name is John. It is? Yeah, Master Chief's name is John. Oh. Kings Bravo, is it John Smith? I don't know what the last name is. I want to play through Halo 3. Enjoy it very Me too. much. I love Halo 3. I did not play the other one. Oh, I played, uh, I, I mean, I really loved Halo in high school. I know, oh, I mean, I don't know, I mean, I played Halo, Halo 2, Halo 3, I did not play the other one. Oh, I see. Yeah, I played up the Halo 3. Halo 2 was my absolute favorite. Mine too. Yeah. I had a lot of memories. So well, Halo 2. How about the uh, new noob combo, SMG and plasma yeah. pistol? Yeah. So you fucking charge up the plasma pistol, hit him with that, and then just two yeah. shots yeah. with the uh, SMG finishes them. Infestation is what's coming for you. Soon all will serve as form. God, she's got fucking glowy eyes. Trying to get in our heads, man. We better keep it together. If we're gonna pull this camera right. off, we need to rally this as many not too survivors as we can. But, uh... Commander, <laughs> I'm gonna have to focus up a bit. Okay. It'd be creepy having sex with that chick, though. Under heavy Blue eyes. eyes. No, I kind of want to see it. All right. Let's I don't know if she'd have reproductive organs in uh, any manner in which uh, a real humans are. We won't have a uh, to stop yeah. Her. But um, if she has any type of insect orifice... Oh my yeah. god, dude, we're done. <laughs> okay, sorry. We're done. <laughs> right, sorry, sorry, sorry. Anyway, current mission, Gates of Hell. Mercenaries are more effective on missions where resources and supplies are limited. Yes. Keep that in mind. Make the vegetables made. What? Sorry. That was the thing that was in the corner before, kind of. Oh, yeah. Like, <laughs> fucking game learn, again. Learn to grow vegetables until they're made. I don't remember what it said exactly yeah. either, but... Yeah, it was odd. <laughs> anyway. Uh, da 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 Get a marauder in there. Marauder in there. Actually, we're gonna go ahead and distribute these things in an appropriate manner. Good thing. We might just have a chance of fighting our way through this. All right. Keep pumping SCVs. Getting that shit going. All right. Yeah. Um. 
We're going to have drop pods coming down, Sir, I'm yeah. tracking and then we go and grab the uh, units there. Yeah, they're always uh, guarded by some uh, Zerg units. But uh, we're going to go after that one after I get a couple of... Uh, oh, wait, I have a couple of minutes. What's in uh, the drop pod? Mm -hmm. Just resources? Yeah, no, these guys. Oh. The units come down the drop pods. You don't get to control them? Not until control. I go rescue them. Because uh -huh. they're trapped behind enemy lines and shit. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and grab these guys and move on. The doctor is in. And some Zerglings or something are going to pop up out of here. And, uh... Or not. Okay, cool. I like cool. the free units. Yeah. Well, this is the beginning of the mission, too. Yeah, but... Are you doing this on Brutal? <laughs> Actually, yeah, I hope so. <laughs> I'm doing it at least on hard, because it's on... Uh, the speed is fast. Yeah. So, we know that much. Anyway. Okay, we'll go ahead and... Dump that Marauder the Marines in there. Alright. Uh... Uh-oh. Some came down and killed all my SCVs. So that happened. Um, yeah. We're gonna push through this issue. This isn't good. Okay, yeah, you need to go straight over there. Sir, I've detected this a drop as much percent. mining time as possible now. Alright, so yeah, how's your life going? Uh, pretty good. Um, going through some interviews, making some new jobs. Indeed. Uh, I actually had a lot of fun talking about myself today. Yeah, you but, usually tend to enjoy that. Yeah, <laughs> I mean, I, I talk about plant tissue culture, I talk about PCR and thermocyclers, and I got to talk about primer design, and this woman was just like, she knew everything I was talking about, and we were having a very good, like, back and forth discussion. Um, so it was cool talking to a scientist. I want to be able to do that every day. Well, um, I'm not good enough for you? Well, I don't want to have to talk to people where I have to speak in broken English so they understand me. Wow. Wow. Dick. I'm not... What? I'm just saying... I'm not, you don't I wasn't speak talking to me to in broken English. I wasn't talking to you. Oh, saying, like, I see what work. you're doing. Okay. Yeah, you know, like what I... You know what I'm, you know what I'm talking about. Because, honestly, my vocabulary has really gone downhill in the past two years because to be understood, I have to speak in broken English. Like, you no good at no nodding, needing nod things. Whatever. Yeah. Actually, that well was even worse than, worse than what I could expect. But um, people understand me better when I break things up, and I can't even use big words anymore. Sending coordinates to a All right. Drop. Like when you talk, and then like you're like stuck on a word, and I'm trying to guess a million times, and mm -hmm. you hate when I do that. Uh, it's like what I do in my own head. I'm trying to guess what my last word is that I'm trying to think of because I can't, I can't even remember. All right, uh, let's see here. I think I may just let that one go. Mm. I don't need a factory. It's kind of far away. Yeah, I'm just gonna let that, those guys die. <coughs> I am a heartless, heartless person. Yeah. Anyway. But yeah. Yeah, we're just securing our base right now. Are you excited to work tomorrow? Well, I mean, it's not so bad. It'll be weird working on Saturday, but. Like, like I said to you before when you were saying that, I today feels like Thursday, tomorrow feels like Friday. Yeah, but you only get one day for freaking drinking yeah. heavily. Yeah. <laughs> well, yeah, life's hard, and then you die. Mm -hmm. That's not so bad. Uh, yeah. I got paid today, so I'm happy Indeed. about that. Indeed, yeah, that's that's I always nice. My paycheck. Uh, I, I do I that already, on my phone. I already spent half of it. On uh, bills and shit? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Actually, I also hate adult responsibilities. I'm spending more in groceries than I thought I would. Why? Just because uh, there's a lot of things that I actually use that I don't really think of. Like, making sure that I'm caught up on toilet paper and toothpaste and uh, shower stuff. Like, yeah, you do spend way up. too much on shower stuff. <laughs> hey, well, it lasts me a good amount of time. I don't, it's not like I, I throw it so. out. I hope so. You're only fucking one guy. Yeah, I just had like 16 different types of conditioners. Drop pod is coming down near your Which, location. by the way, my hair is fucking atrocious today. Oh, this God, you're just so awful. Right? Upgrade. I need to, I'm putting under a hat tomorrow. 
But that's another reason why I want to work at a later time, as opposed to waking up at 3.30 every morning. Yeah, let's just get old pretty quick. Yeah, I want to be able to shower, <coughs> and, like, let my hair dry, and like, enjoy my coffee, and watch the news. Well, unfortunately, uh, I wouldn't do that anyway, because I'm irresponsible. But, uh, you just sleep until you have to go to yeah, work. <laughs> yeah. I just sleep a little bit more. See, I'm, in, going into work later, yeah, I get extra sleep, but uh, I just... I like relaxing a little bit before going to work. Oh, I like to do it. I just never do. Well, again, uh, it's just not a thing I do. Yeah. I can't do graveyard shift, but when I work second shift, uh, I'd have to be at work until 2. Uh, I'd wake up at 9. I'd go do all my grocery shopping. I'd go walk around, go get lunch or something, or hang out with my friends. And then, like, around uh, 1, I'd shower. I'd go to work. And I'd get home at, like, 11. And I have the option. Do I stay up until 3 in the morning or do I go to bed? Because usually around that time I'm tired. Uh, so I go to bed if I'm tired or if I, I want to stay up. I'll fucking stay up all night actually. Because then I can sleep all day if I need to. It's just this weird time that we're working now. I get home at 2. It's still daylight out. I can't go to bed until like 8 or 9. Yeah, I'm going to let that one die too. You're missing out? Not missing out. Don't need a starport. Since I'm marine medicing it up. Okay. What's the what's the big plan on this? You have oh, to just, just kill everything. Well, I'm waiting for the drop pods to all finish up. Uh, gather a large army. I'm going to complete just through uh, building units, which is the first objective. And as soon as I reach that, uh, it'll show me a cutscene, and do then I have SCV, a new objective. Do your SCVs count as? No. Nope. They are, do not do not claim on as army units, but I've already got it. Mayday, Mayday, this is General Warfield. My ship has taken terrible, terrible damage. Terrible, terrible damage. That's become a meme among Blizzard fans. Oh. Terrible, terrible damage. Our tank is taking terrible, terrible damage. Oh my God. People don't even know where it comes from most of the time now. They'll be fine for as long as I fucking wait. At least yeah. as far as I know. Friggin' I've never seen them over. Are they making a base? Yeah, well, they're just building some bunkers. <laughs> Those bunkers are different than yours. No, well, maybe. They may not have the Neo Steel upgrade that I have. But yeah, we're gonna hear her screaming about how our allies base is under attack a lot. Yeah. But they won't die. No, they, I, again, maybe they would eventually, but I've never been, uh, had this mission last long enough for that to actually be a factor. Anyway, uh, we'll see if we can't squeeze one more, uh, one more freaking episode out of this yeah, mission. It is about that time. Because it is about that time. Oh, God, Banelinks. I hate Banelinks. Yeah. Anyway, uh, yeah. So we're going to go ahead and save it to Hit the Sauce Gaming here. Subscribe to Hit subscribe the Sauce. Subscribe to Hit the Sauce Gaming. We don't need to save to it, but subscribe to it. Again, pretty some pretty solid advice. Yeah. And, uh, oh, yeah, we'll see you guys later. Bye. Yeah, subscribe to Hit the Sauce. Yeah. So that's, that's, that's a very, very tricky, uh, subtle thing that we did there. Yeah, I'm, I like it. it. I, was, I, I read this thing that, like, uh, when you're tell, asking people to subscribe... If you do it in like a, uh, in a, not just a like, comment, subscribe kind of way, but in a mm -hmm. sort of unique way, uh, they're more likely to do it. So I'm trying yeah. to fuck with their minds and outsmart them. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah. Because they're all stupid. Way. Are we still recording? I think so. Oh, shit.